Hey guys, okay, I, disclaimer, all right, I know, disclaimer, because I don't wanna hear it. Like, I have no makeup on, okay? I have no makeup on, and I have a spot right here, okay? Because I have some kind of, like, freckle. It's so fucking, no, it's not a freckle, it's like a dark spot or something, and it looks like I have a dimple in my, so, anyway, I asked my doctor, I was like, can, I was like, what can, I, whatever, so he prescribed me this, like, cream or something to put on, and it's, I put on at night, and it's starting to, like, get rough almost like a scab so I think it's gonna like flake off I don't know hopefully it will work it's like a really weird like f like just sunspot I don't know what the fuck it is so that's why this looks bad okay shut up just shut up I already know it like, so fucking annoying okay also okay before I get started um so I'm gonna do my makeup but okay I am I have like so much to talk to you guys about right um this song okay and by the way okay I'm pissed because you ruined my video last time it's, it's, uh, this is what happened I never listen to any fucking one ever. Okay, I never listen to anyone. I never will. I never will. And the reason I listened to this person who emailed in because he sounded like he knows he what he was doing. I was like, maybe I'm old and don't get it. Like maybe this is why like my my channel doesn't grow. Grow. Like maybe my videos are too long. He basically like read me the riot app, telling me that like I shouldn't do long videos, and like made, like wrote up this whole thing as to like how I I should like do how tos or like bitch. This is a thing. I'm not going to conform to anyone I never do. And I like kind of listen to him. Like, hey, I'm just going to do a short video. Maybe I'm like making an ass of myself. But like, I was right. Okay. Leave me alone. Do not give me suggestions. Your suggestions are not needed. Do not write me emails. Do not give me suggestions. Like I'm going to do whatever the fuck I want to do. And everyone gets the vibe. So they will love it. If they don't love it, then they don't watch. Like, period. Leave me alone. Like, anyway, you ruined my last video. Okay. Because I listened to you only because I'm like, maybe you're old, Alex. Like maybe it's like, get with the program and just like listen to like people who are younger like no why would I ever do that okay for a story of business ruin my video like ruin my fucking video okay um the next thing I'll talk about oh my god I did something I legitimately did something okay so look at this drink okay it kind of looks like disgusting as fuck now but if you have not been blocked on Instagram you'll know what I was saying you'll you'll have already seen it this was all pink so there was like a recipe. That's what I kind of like about my Starbucks here. Mmm. It's so good. Some Starbucks do it. Some Starbucks don't. Where they have like a menu. They have like the menu up, right? And then like um, they have like a special recipe they put up. And my hair looks crazy. They have like a special recipe up. Like something that like the staff created. And this one was like something about a mocha with um, mocha with strawberry like foam or strawberry foam on top. And I was like, oh my God, I could totally like create something with that. So I asked for, oh my God, it's so good. It's a little bit, okay, the thing is the way they had it was like fatso, was like so fatso, bitch. Like, oh my God, if anyone ordered that drink as is, fatso, fatso, okay, like no. Like legitimately, I was like, oh my God, who would actually go in and order this? You might as well go to Ruby's and order a milkshake. Like, why are you even, like, it's just so stupid. Like, no one's, who the fuck would be like, I want to have, I want to have like, like a, a, a chocolate, it's so annoying. Like Frappuccino is the most annoying thing in the world to me. It's so immature. Okay. So, um, I was like, oh my God, it's the best idea ever. So I got three shots. Okay. This is what we are doing. This is what we are doing, you guys. All right. Oh my God. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm like so excited. I'm also pissed. I'm so excited. I'm excited to tell you guys about I'm pissed. Like I got so much to talk to you about and I'm just really mad about, don't even want to go there. Okay. Other things that we can't speak about. Okay. So, um, this is three shots of espresso over ice with extra ice. You better write this down, okay? Three shots of espresso over ice with extra ice with one pump of vanilla and then they make a strawberry sweet co sweet cream, sweet cold foam. Strawberry sweet cold foam. I think what they do is like blend some strawberry into their sweet cold foam. The thing is, it's not... Fat. I don't know if it's fattening. Okay, I'm sure there's calories in it, obviously. Um, but it's really good. It's a little. If you don't, it's not too sweet either. It's not. You. The thing is, you need to have like a little. I should have gotten sugar-free vanilla. God damn it! I should have gotten sugar-free vanilla. So next time, I, tomorrow. Okay, this thing. It's a little bit acidic. Like I'm not gonna lie, it's a little tiny bit acidic. It's kind of like burning the fuck out of my stomach. Like really burning. It, it kind of. It kind of like you know how you eat like pickles, like a ton of pickles on like an empty stomach. Like that's what it would taste like. It's like eating my stomach because it's like real, it's like just espresso with like acidic strawberry. I don't know, but it's really good. It, I, I didn't, I was like, wait, is coffee? That's why I put the vanilla shot in it thinking it would like calm it down a little bit. It didn't really, but I really like it. It's kind of different. I was getting, I have been in the worst mood for like three days because I'm kind of over Starbucks. Like I don't like, 
I have no like recipe ideas. I have no drink ideas. Like I have nothing, nothing to look forward to in my life right now. I'm living in a war zone. Like my house is completely topsy turvy. Like, okay, so this is really good. Um, I'm happy I found something. It's really good. It's actually really good. I'm just kind of enjoying it. I'm just kind of enjoying it. Like it's just something I really like it. So try this, get it like that. It's really good. No milk, no milk in it. Okay, disgusting. Baby Huey, stop. Okay, all right, I'm gonna put on my, okay. So before I get started, like the lighting kind of like, goes, I don't know, I'm, okay, so I think because like I, my house is like so many trees around and stuff, like the, I'm just not used to um, the lighting here yet. Um, I, I really hate when I start looking like a fucking dictator, like Kim Jong-un with like hair like that, you know what I mean? Um, I hate it, it looks like, it looks so, I can honestly are you guys the same way where you can look really fucking ugly you know what I mean like like you're actually not ugly but you can look so fucking ugly like that's me like I'm the ugliest person sometimes it's so scary but like I'm not ugly I don't get it okay like God fucks with me all right um so there I think it's like not bad it's like kind of cute okay um all right I have like dry shampoo in my hair I'm gonna look so pretty after this shut up Okay, um, I want to talk about, actually, I just want to put on my earrings with you guys. This is my new, um, it's called my Rue necklace, and I love it so fucking much. So there's little pave links in this every so often, and it's like my new favorite piece. You're probably going to see me wearing it all the time. Probably as much as my Studio 54 is. I'm kind of obsessed with it. I know the lighting is like fucking crap in here as always, but um, this is just, you guys know I don't show like all of my jewelry all the time. But there's some things I'm just like, it's a must. Like, you guys know I wear these all the time. Okay, I have new earrings. I want to put them in, in on with you because... I just launched them last night and my nose is running. I don't care. Leave me all fuck alone. Stop. I don't care. I'm not allowed to wipe my nose. Like, we've been here for too long. We've been here for too long. I told you guys, like, to be honest, I'm that comfortable with you where I could just, like, get naked and get dressed in front of you. Like, I don't care anymore. I'm just, like, too much effort. Too much effort to, to, we have, I know you guys. Like, I, we know each other stuff. Okay. So, anyway, um, diet soda. All right, here we go. I'm so excited. My nose is running. I don't care. I have allergies. Leave me the fuck alone. It's like everyone thinks of like coronavirus. We have, have runny nose now. Shut up. All right. So my new diet soda earrings are so sick. Neon pink. And then I have mint and baby blue. And I have white. Here is white. And then I have bracelets too. Okay. So bracelets as well. Let me show you the bracelets, how they work. I didn't wear a bracelet because I want to wear earrings. I don't think I want to do bracelet and matching earrings, but you guys know my line is all about like sick hardware. And so here's like the white and then the pink. I'm so in love with them, like so sick. And I'm using my favorite Mignon chain on these. Um, okay. And then, sorry, like I have like a nasal drip like right here. And it's like, not going to go away. And I honestly don't want to get a Kleenex. Like, I just don't want to get up and get a Kleenex. Let me talk about Okay, I know, so gross. Okay, um, here's the white one. I got caught with another earring. Here's the white. Okay, so I think I'm gonna wear, I just love the neon. Okay, my two favorites are the neon and the pink, honestly. Like, these are my two favorites. I also love the baby blue. I think they're so cute. So I think I'm gonna wear the neon. I'm gonna wear, I think I'm gonna wear, I'm gonna wear two, but I think three is cute too. And let me guys show you guys. So you guys are really loving these, so I wanna show you what they look like on. You can also buy these alone so you don't have to choose the um the hoop to go with it you can just buy these charms alone on the listing you can choose with or without and i look crazy okay um with or without so if you want to like you know do something if you have a hoop or whatever or you have like one of these you can always put it on it whatever okay but i would suggest and then i have these too much you guys i have pave versions as well um I know some people, I get really nervous when I show my lines. I feel like you guys don't want to hear it, but a lot of people, I should bother me. Like, you won't, you won't let me do what I want to do. Bother me. Like, like, just leave me alone. Stop. Stop right now. I'm going to fucking block you. Like, I swear you're so annoying. Okay. Um, you know what it is? It's like one person leaves a comment and I see it. It annoys the fuck out of me. You know what I mean? I like remember it. It like bother, bothers me like to fucking hell. Okay. And then I have these um, pave versions and um, I put them both on gold hoops just because I like I think it looks better. So you can choose silver option or gold. If you really want a silver hoop too, I will do that for you. But I really like the mixed metal and the, the um, detail on these is ridiculous. It's so gorgeous. Okay, so you can wear two um, if you want like this. 
Okay. And then let me show you two um, of the, let me show you which color would I do with that on this side. I kind of like the neon with the light blue. See, I just, you guys like bother me when I, you won't let me do what I want. So I love the two. I think it's really cool and unique. I like it like that, but I have other options. So I'm going to put this one on the other side somewhere. I think here. So let me show you guys the vibe. Okay. So I have these two just like minimal one, just little hoops. So a lot of my earrings, like with these two, you can take the charms off the hoops and wear them with, you know what I mean, alone. And that's what I did with these. I took like the charms off these and just left these there. So I'm going to keep the back simple, I think. Okay. And then I have my, um, no bad vibes eyes and they look like real eyes they look like glass real eyes and they have these really cool spike details at the bottom and then you guys are like loving everything these are selling like really really fast and so they're, they're gorgeous like the, the fucking vibe is sick i'll show you but you don't have you, you've already seen them but i want to show you how i wear them and then you can choose different hoop colors like green emerald pink or diamond and they're they are crystals okay and then like the tear ducts are also little cz crystals so this one is green and then I also have it in pink and I have white. Um, where is the pink? So I think I'm just going to choose the green one because for my grape soda. Yeah. Okay. Then I have my uh, crushed grape and my crushed grape is everything is like, like soda. -y, okay. It's like soda -y and like whatever the eyes don't, but I just love like this, the all three together, the eye with this big crystal. I just love it so much. So sick. So I think I'm going to put the eye on the back. Let me see. Okay, I'm going to put the eye on the back. Like that. And I'm going to put the little grape in the middle. I think it looks better the opposite way, honestly, but I can switch it. I forget. I forget what I did my picture yesterday. Like, just so fucking cute. I mean, just to die for, honestly. I mean, I, look, I've never seen anything like this before in my life. It's one of those things where I just, like, can't even. Like, it, this speaks to me so much. It's so fucking sick. Like, if I saw someone with this ear stack, I'd be like, like, how are you so fucking, like, how do you just get it? Like, how, how is this vibe just everything? So these um, charms for the eye and the crush grape, they don't come out, um, off, so they are attached. But, like, the um, diet soda, um, they do come off. So, um... Is that what we're doing today? I think we're doing it like that. Yeah, I just think I love that so much. So sick. Let me see. Or, I don't know. If you, I just don't want you guys to be like, that's too much. You know what I mean? And then not like buy all three. So I'm going to do it in a more, even though I wear it like that, I want to do it in a more wearable way so that you, okay, I know that you'll wear that. And then I'm going to put this one in from, this is another hoop that I have for my day tonight. You guys probably have these too. This is the hoop from the, um, the chain or the little pavé. So you just, this is like effortless, okay? So then on the other side, I'm going to put the eye in the front, I think. Like that. So one, one, one. And then I think I want to put, let me see how this looks, in the back. Okay. So I just like can't. It's so fucking cute. To be honest, I wish I had another one of these right now for my day tonight to put in the middle here. I think this is a little bit too high. I'm just gonna put a grape crush, I think, in the middle. Let me see. Because I want to, okay? I love wearing all three. Even though you guys are probably like, it's too much. It's not fucking too much. I swear to God, it's so cute. It's not fucking too much. It's not too much. You need it. You need it. It's so sick. Like, you need it. Okay. I, I, I'm sorry I'm obsessed. I'm fucking obsessed. I'm dead. I'm, I'm just fucking dead. Like, it's the cutest thing in the world. It's the cutest thing in the fucking world. Okay. Um, so bracelets, earrings, I have everything for you. And then this too. Um, this one is like when you'll be seeing me wearing it all the time. Okay. I know that like the lighting is a little bit weird, but we're over it. Okay. So now I'm going to start my makeup and I'm also going to take you guys downstairs to do, to show you, I'm not going to like 
do the best job. I was going to do like, we'll see. I don't know how I feel. This morning I tweeted to you guys, um, where's my shit? Who the fuck is my phone? I tweeted you guys like what I was going to do. <sighs> rich face, like rich. What's it, what did I say it was? My rich face look and zero calorie fridge. So I'm going to take you downstairs to my fridge. And I have my fridge set up to be like, okay, my fridge set up is genius. Okay. Please say it like that. I'm told you there's like palm trees and they like sway in the wind. And then like the sun's weird right now. Let me try to back up a little bit. Um, and I have my fridge set up like, um, like, like for success, bitch. So a lot of like, okay, I'll tell you guys downstairs, but, um, I'm going to take, if, if you, you got to have to, you have to stay to the end to see the, um, this is better like out of the. Out of the light. I don't know. I'm really, I'm like the ugliest person sometimes. Like I don't understand how I like look so ugly. Um. All right. So I hate people. Don't say you're ugly. Don't say it about yourself. Um. I, I honestly don't really want to talk about products. I just don't want to talk about products right now. So I'm not going to. Okay. So I was gonna do like my rich face, but I kind of like don't know. Sorry, I can't. Like, I'm really happy. I'm just really, really happy about it. Like, I'm just... That's one of those things, okay? Um, okay, so I'm going to take you guys downstairs, and I'm going to show you guys my fridge. Um, and it's just, like, set up for success. Like, it really is this set up for success. And you guys know this tarp in the back is not, like, a backdrop. Oh, my God. This is construction going on in my house. And to be honest, I had to, like... I had to be crazy this morning because he... I. This is the thing. You guys don't know, but I'm really nice. Like, I'm really nice, and I will be cool with you for the first 5,000th time, but if you're going to start screwing me over because you think I'm dumb, then no. Do your work, and do your, just stop. Don't don't tell me that I changed my mind a million times. I actually didn't change my mind. I want to tell you guys something right now. Um, to be honest, please don't tell me I forgot that. No, I didn't. Um, to be honest, okay, Have you? let me tell you guys the truth. This is the kind of fucking psycho bitch I am. Um, and even Nick was like, I just honestly can't believe that you didn't, like, that you just, like, decided on something and told them what to do without getting a rendering. Because Nick is in design. Um, I don't talk about it. Because he's on my shit list right now. Like, everyone's on my shit list. Um, what the fuck? I forgot the court! The one fucking thing. Stupid fuck. So fucking important that I left it right here. The one thing I fucking need. So smart. Like, honestly, I'm so annoying. Oh, let me show you this, too. Um, This is another necklace. It's called So HRH, and I'm really obsessed with it. I used my sport club style chain on it, so it has, like, a slightly darker color on purpose because it wasn't... I'm not, I'm not explaining my design process. So you fucking pose up. No, what's it called? Copy, copy and paste cunts, okay? Copy and paste. Fuck you, all right? So, um, not going to explain my design theory to you, but, um, so here's a necklace called So HRH and I use, this is like a huge pink crystal. It's like a little bit smaller, it's bigger than the grape. And then I have a new clochette. It's like a jumbo sick gold clochette. And I'm not sure if you can see how gorgeous this crystal is, but, um, it's just really, really, really gorgeous. Um, and then there's a clasp in the back. So it's really easy to put on the clochette. It's just there for decoration. Not because the clochettes are hard to use. You know what I mean? So whenever I use clochettes, I like to use them, make them so you don't have to use them actually because but, like, it's just so sick. And of course, if you don't want the crystal, I know some people like boys and stuff would just want it without. So you can always just email me and I can do it without. But really, really another sick piece I just launched yesterday. Okay. Um, so yeah, um, um, by the way, would you tell me right now, oh, sorry, it's been 20 minutes, oh my God, see what I mean? Like, that guy was like, you shouldn't do, you shouldn't do long videos. Like, honestly, don't, don't, don't do that. Like, did I ask you to tell me what to do? Did I ask you to, was I like, oh my God, you guys, like, on, like, I really need help figuring out, um, like, why no one watches my, my videos. That's not the problem. We never said that. I never, ever in a million years said that. What I said is I don't gain a, I don't get a, a follower. And that's all I said. So I don't understand like why you, you had felt the need to come and tell me to not make long videos. That wasn't a problem. I'm annoyed. I'm just annoyed by that. Unsolicited advice. Unsolicited advice. Like, 
Was I soliciting advice from you? Don't try. And you know, the thing is like when people tell you, oh, good luck. I hate that too. Like that thing that bothers me so much. Like don't tell someone good luck because bitch, like had there's a lot of things in my mind. Um, I really like, I'm not in like the mood right now. Okay. Bronzer. I think I'm just going to do this first. I always use, this is just really not the best right now. It's like really kind of ruining my face. But what I've been doing is just kind of covering it with bronzer as much as I can because I like to use a lot of bronzer. I feel like I look so much better with like just a more tan face. Plus it was, being not tan reminds me of when I was like huge two years ago. And I just can't remember I was doing like a super white, like basically like a really, really white pale face. Now it's like completely different. Like we don't do that anymore at all. Um... I was really gonna focus today, honestly, on doing my like rich face, but I'm kind of like things happened this morning, and like I had to get kind of crazy, so I'm just like not really in the mood. I kind of wanted to show you guys my fright. I don't want to tell you guys a story too. I have like a story to tell you. This it feels really hard right now. Like it feels like a, like it's starting to scab. Hey, you want to sit with me? I know. I'm doing a film. I'm doing video. Here, you want to say hi? Okay. Okay, sit down. She wants to sit with me. Okay, um, so then I'm going to put some more bronzer on, which is like a little bit of a fluffy brush with this. Um, okay. Um, anyway, so, yeah, like, I'm literally living in a war zone, and what I've learned, anyway, what I was saying, I'm all over the place, sorry. Okay, so yeah, Nick, he is like in the, in the I honestly can't believe that you just didn't ask for a rendering or something before you did the kitchen. Like, he's like, do you know how many times, like, when we're doing designs or something, like, people ask for, like, renderings, and they change things, like, 75 times. He's like, I, I just can't believe what you did. And I was like, because I know exactly what I want. Like, I don't need that. Like, I actually don't need, I, I don't need to be confused. Like, this is what I like. Like, these are, like, the, do this cabinet, do it in this color. Like, I don't want what, what, what are you rendering for? I'm sorry, like, wh why are we doing a rendering? Waste time? Like, I don't get it. Um, but I know a lot of you guys are out there. No one out there, I'm sorry, and I don't want to hear it. No one out there is going to be like, I did the same thing, Alex. Like, I also didn't, didn't ask for a rendering. I'm, I know you did. I know you did. Dude. Yeah, so, um, kitchen's still not done. Nothing's still done. So I had to get crazy. Because I honestly, like, I'm getting, the thing is, like, I'm getting taken advantage of with timeline. It's starting to fucking irritate me. So we already knew about that. And it's like, I just wish that you would just be me, just don't lie, don't lie to me to get the job. That's what it is. You know what I mean? It bothers me. All right, um. So I just kind of like, to, I don't think we're doing, this is like not end up being, ending up being like super rich face day actually. It's really not, but I just have to like get some color on the eyebrow and then afterwards I'm able to like kind of play with it. You know what I mean? I've learned a lot of lessons with this whole remodel thing. Um, I don't know. It's my first time doing it, but I don't listen to anyone. You know what I mean? Everyone could have told me a million times something and I would have done it my way anyway. So, it's fine. I And I am a little bit, to be honest, I'm a little bit concerned that I would just like, we've tons of vibe everywhere. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, I was a little, I'm a little bit, so I did one minor change, not minor change, I added something basically just to kind of break it up a little bit because I was like kind of nervous it was going to look a little bit too plain. And to be honest, I'm like nervous too because you know the house it came with, oh my God, like, do you see how automatically prettier with these eyebrows? Um, they have to be straight though. Um, remember, do you guys know like the double oven my house came with? It's like this double oven and it's like a, it's a good brand, but it's kind of like not, it, it doesn't like fit my vibe. It's kind of protrudes a little bit and like it has, um, it kind of protrudes a little bit from the wall. So, 
um, I, I think I need one that's like flat, like looks like glass. So the thing is that when I, when we're done, when I, um, sorry, um, I'm going to have them put it in, put it in. I'm just going to show you guys it. And if it like completely ruins, cause I'm trying to save money, of course, like it's not like a, a bad stove. So like, why would I get rid of it? Like, or, you know what I mean? Like, why don't I just try to deal with it? Um, then I will get rid of it, but I'm just trying to use like use the appliances. I mean, obviously the Sub-Zero is fine, but it's just like all this stuff is better than anything I've ever had. So I'm good with it. Okay. Do we love like, okay, I'm kind of starting to feel like myself again. It's so fucking ugly. Do you know who Eileen Warnos is? That's who I feel like with no makeup on. I literally feel like I look like her. Like, I just feel like I look like a big lesbian murderer. Like, no joke. I've already told you guys that in the past. I feel like Eileen Morno sometimes. Okay. I kind of feel like I, I kind of feel like I understand. No, I'm kidding. Okay. Um, all right. So, of course, like, this fucking light is following me, like, to a T. Like, bitch, what is your problem? The fuck is your problem, to be honest. Okay. Um. So, then I'm just going to do... So, sometimes lately I've been doing no eyes. I can't, should I just not do eyes today? I was going to do eyes. I kind of don't feel good. I'm not doing eyes today. I don't feel good. I haven't been doing eyes. I feel like I look prettier right now. I, I love doing the two eye, the two cat eye things. You know what I mean? It's, like, so rich. I love it. It's so bougie. It's so weird. And it's so, like, you don't, you're not from here. It's like, like, why would you wear that? Why would she wear that, that, that eye? Like, why did her eyebrows like that? Like, she's not, that's, like, really weird. Like, no one would do that. Like, where is she from? That's what I want. I don't want to, I don't, I don't like anyone. I don't like you. Like, leave me alone. I don't want to look like you. I don't want to act like you. I don't want to be around you. You know what I mean? Like, I want to be around me. Like, no one understands, like, that there's no one's a vibe. You're killing my vibe, okay? So, um, all right, I'm going to, so I've been, like, loving to, I kind of, like, just love doing, like, a really strong eye, eyebrow, and then no eyes, and then, like, my lip, of course. I have to fix my lips. You guys know I was born... God fucked up my lips so bad. We already know it. I have like ugly lips. I can't stand it. It's like, and then I filled them too. So I just, the thing is that my opening is not big enough. Like it's, I have a, a small mouth opening and then I have like, I just like, I, I hate it. Like I hate that a lot of girls with like the, 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 the like a small, if you have a small mouth and you got injections, you look like a, you have an anus for a fucking mouth. Like calm down on it and do what I'm doing, bitch. Cause like mine are not that bad you know what I mean like they're not disgusting but the, like I just was not born with like a, like the lip shape that I desire but I think I was able to like to reconstruct it a little bit dude like the fucking shadows in here are scaring me because I I see something it's like the trees sway and just like another thing okay um so anyway I'm gonna tell you a story too that's like really annoyed me and it kind of like so are you following me on twitter if you're not like kind of tweet a lot lately just because I don't like I honestly the more you tell me not to say something and the more you try and like um not the word I'm like cancel because that's just so dumb like the more you try to act like I'm like so radical or whatever um the more I just like love to actually say what I love uh, or what I mean or what I like actually think um these like people are so fucking stupid making me sick my sick my son but yesterday I was somewhere um yesterday I was somewhere and. Okay, this is the thing. I also, yeah, so my, for my inspiration for this tweet, you guys are loving my tweets. It's fun. Um, I wrote, yeah, to be honest, I said, you can do it. To be honest, you probably can't. False hope is a waste of time and resources. All right, and this, uh, to be honest, it's kind of true. And it's not, it's not like, you know, don't pursue your dreams. Like, okay, this is the thing with me. My, like, HR didn't happen because I quit my damn day, my, my, my damn day, day, day job and focused on HRV. It's like, oh my God, that kind of shit makes me so, like, I have no respect for you. What I have respect for is someone like, I'm not saying like, I'm not patting myself on the back. Like, I don't actually do that, but I really do like think like, I, I, this didn't just like happen overnight. I was, I had like, I had a real job, like a nine to five working in accounting for like, I forget, it was like a year, year and a half. I forget. Until when I, when I was doing HRH, like until like from like six o'clock to like 
four o'clock in the morning, you know what I mean? Fulfilling orders, do it, filming during like whatever. I was doing it and I did it because I really loved it, okay? So that's the kind of thing, it's like do not quit your day job to pursue your dreams. It's like, oh my God, let, gag me with a fucking spoon, bitch. Like gag me with a fucking spoon. I mean, if you're like fortunate enough to do that and your parents can like, can like whatever support you or whatever, or your husband can, whatever, do it, it's fine. But I'm talking about some dumb, like some dumbass who like, does, who's like fucking broke as shit and like complaining about it and pursuing your dreams. Like that's not the way it works, bitch. Dumbass. Okay. So that, I don't know why I got on that tangent. It has nothing to do with this. But this lady irritated me so much. This is the thing. I'm allowed to be racist against my own kind. Like I'm allowed to be, but I fucking hate this kind of white bitch so much. This is another reason why I don't even want to be white. I don't want to be any, any race because I just feel like I want to be, I'm like me. I don't relate to anyone. It's like the weirdest fucking thing. Like I don't get it. People just irritate that. But I wanted to wring her neck and be like, you are so like, what's the word? Tone deaf, bitch. You are so tone deaf. Like I can't even start with you. I want to punch you out because you're dumb. Like you're not giving this girl good advice. You're like basically showing off, acting like you're the shit. Okay. I love you so much. I really love you. You're my angel. You're my good girl, but I do a video right now. I do a video. I mean, I'm doing a video right now. See, she, she stands up and like wants me to hold her. So she wants me to go. Okay, um, let me just do my lips first. See what I'm doing, how I'm fixing like the shape. And I told you guys on this side, like, um, I haven't gotten a cold sore in probably like, a year or over a year, I think. But whenever I get a cold sore, it's always right there in the same place. It's like the weirdest shit ever. Like, I don't understand, like, wait, you why do you want to keep eating away at that corner of my lip? So I have like an indentation and a like, scar right here. So it's just even worse. It, like, if it wasn't, if my mouth wasn't ugly enough already, okay, stop. I mean, can I please put you down? I really have to do my makeup. Come on. She's so needy. I mean, please don't. No, I will, I mean, I already took you on the longest walk. We went to Starbucks. I took her. I will take her again later too. When you get Diet Coke later, I'm going to take you. She's so fucking needy lately. Lately, I don't get it. Lay down. Lay down. Just stop, stop, stop. This is the best lip liner too, I feel like for me. So if you guys wanna get it, I'll put the link below. It's like the one that doesn't make me look dead. A lot of the nude colors are too dead for me. And then a lot of the cranberry ones are too red. Sorry, all that noise, they are like, I think they're like pulling down um, some of my palm trees because they are um, like just fucked up, okay? The leaves, so sorry. I had to figure that out this morning. Okay, these are not the best, but I feel like it's better than what I had. Definitely isn't the rich face. Okay, but let me just finish my eyebrows a little bit. Then...
Okay, so I'm gonna tell you a story. I have to make sure my lips are like not ridiculous, but. So let me take this down. Um, okay, so where's my brush? All right, so anyway, let me tell you guys quickly about the story. And then I'm going to take you down to my, I'm going to get a brush too. Um, so I, all right, so I was at this place. And I don't want to say where I was. But um, where, how am I going to describe it? Um, okay. Okay. Let's put it this way. I was there for business, okay? And I don't want to say like where, what it is or whatever. Um, I was there for business. So it's kind of like a place where people go for, um, what's the word? Materials, okay? And um, it's like if you go in there, typically like you have like some kind of a line. Like you have like, you know, like a jewelry line, jewelry line, or, or you manufacture something or you're, it's like, it's a large, it's like a factory situation. Okay. And the people that work there, I'm not, you guys are gonna get pissed, but like, let's just, let's just cut the crap. What, these are vocabulary words. You fucking pussy. Hold on. Let me get my fucking brush now. Honestly, I want to wring her neck. So this bitch, um, okay. So I was in there. And I was doing my own thing. Like I was, I was, whatever, doing my own thing there. And I was overhearing. So, okay, let's put it this way. People who work there are like, just like, like low skilled, just working class people. Okay. And let's just, let's just cut the crap right now. You fucking shit stirring Gen Z piece of shit. No, nothing. Good for nothing. Loser. Okay. I'm allowed to say what I see. You dumb shit. Okay. Moron. So it's not like I'm making fun of anyone. I'm always a preface something with every something, preface something. My grandparents came here as immigrants, okay? So if you're gonna like try and paint me out as some sort of like heartless, racist, and by the way, everything that I have, I've earned by myself. I don't have any, no one funded my ass, okay? So fuck you, all right? Anyway, just wanna get it out of the way. I don't want you saying anything. You irritate the fuck out of me, you're a fucking loser. Focus on your damn self. Why are you even here watching me? Like, why are you just a fucking loser? Okay. So people who are working there are like, they're just like normal working, like, 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 okay, what's the word? There's a lower class, middle class, upper class. Put it that way. Okay. No, you don't like it, but it's fucking fact. They're lower, the lower class. Okay. What are you going to do? Shoot me in the motherfucking head for saying what, what, what the fucking truth is. I'm not making fun of anyone. For fuck's sake. Okay. The, and the, the, I was overhearing this conversation of this woman there and I was overhearing this conversation of this woman there and she was talking to one of the girls, like the, like the, 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 the employee there who was like, just like a low, a low, a low skilled worker. Okay. I don't know what the fucking word is. You guys are going to fucking literally chop my fucking dick off. All right. Um, and now when I say that to people are like, oh my God, like, wait, you have a dick. Okay, um, so she was like, I don't get to the story. I can't get to the story because I, you guys don't understand the fucking pathetic losers I deal with. Come here, stop. Ming, I already took you out. Okay, um, so this, this bitch, and this thing, I told him allowed to be racist against my own kind. This fucking white ass fucking retard bitch, I swear to God, she is just like completely tone deaf, has no fucking idea that this girl is literally like, okay, she doesn't speak English very well. She's not very motivated. Like, she's just working there, bitch. Leave the fucking bitch alone, okay? She just is not there for your grand ideas and your big fucking advice. Pe people are different, okay? It's just, oh my God, I wanted to punch the fuck out. So, so we're at this place and she's like this dumb ass white, white bitch. And she's probably like, I don't know, 42, like a little bit older than me, okay? Like, I'm whatever, I told you guys. 
Um, and she's just like telling this girl who works there, she's like, oh, like I, I, the thing is I'm deaf in one of my ears, right? So it's like hard for me to like, and I don't like to listen to people because I really hate, you just make me like hate you even more, but she wouldn't shut up. So I had to hear. And she's like, she's like, oh, you should really like get into, um, you know, manufacturing and this and that. And you know, every, anyone can do it. And you know, you, you're, you know, you just, just go for it. All right. That kind of a pep talk conversation to a girl who like, she's just, no, it's like, she's just there working, okay? She doesn't want, she's not there for your fucking stupid ass, tone deaf ass pep talk. And the girl was, it was one thing if the girl was asking her questions and it was like, you know, how did you get started? What do you, like, what, what platform are you using? Like, whatever. And this fucking show off bitch was like, oh my gosh, like, it's so, I just had my 7,000th sale. Like, it was like, show, like, like, kind of like trying to like, pep talk her up and like, you know, like give, like, I don't know. Be like, you can do it. You can do it. And like, the girl was like, oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Like was like completely like didn't, I wanted her to leave her the fuck alone so she could go stock the, stock the shelves. You know what I mean? So she'd go like put the supplies away. Like that's the thing. Like she was not there to listen to this dumb ass bitch. Like it, it's just, I was, this is the kind, okay. This is why. This is why I hate my own race, I swear to God, because we are so fortunate and tone deaf. Do you think this girl is taking this, this listening to you and thinking like, you fucking cunt, like it's that, you think it's that easy? Like I am, her situation, this girl's situation was not the same as the dumb fucking white ass dumb bitch, okay, who just had her 7,000 sale, it's so easy. Like the conversation was so bad. Okay, let me tell you, it would be like, I'm just gonna re re really like this. It'd be, I'm really stupid, like in, in school. And like, I, I was really good in college because I took courses that I liked. Right. But in high school I flunked. Okay. I completely flunked. Like I can't, and I seriously can't take tests. Like I, there's something wrong with me. I cannot take a test. I think it's because someone told me what to do. Like I really think that's that. So I just won't do it. Okay. It was like if a brainiac mathematician just came and told me, Alex, it's really great. It's really like, just do it. It's really awesome. Like you can, all you got to do is like study this book and understand it and just do it. It's like so easy. Like, dang, dang. and that was like the kind of like voice she had too. Like why are white people, I want to, I want to wring her neck. Why are white people so annoying like that? Like you're just so tone deaf. If I, I and honestly, I want, I, I wanted, I wanted to leave. I was like, wanted to leave so bad. I was like meeting with one of the guys there and I was like dying to leave. I wanted to leave so bad because I wanted to go be like, you don't, you're like really, really tone deaf. I don't, what's another word about this whole situation? Like, do you not understand there's like different people in the world and not, and obviously this girl is like not going to be able to take your advice just because of like, the situ I mean, the situation that she's in, like she's not even interested in what you're saying. You're being annoying. She just works here. Leave the bitch alone. Like, you know what I mean? It's like, if that's how I would feel if someone was coming at me and telling me something, do you understand what I mean? Do you understand my frustration? Okay, I just really want to, that's what insinuated my, my text, my tweets this morning. Okay, let's go downstairs to my fridge and eat something. I'm honestly really excited to tell you guys this. I'm really, really excited about this. It is like literally sick. Oh. I should, have, I should have done the video right here because look at the lighting. So much better. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, let's go downstairs and I'm gonna try and keep you really close to me because the house is a fucking mess. It's under construction. There's like tape all over the floor. All right, the workers are literally gonna think I'm insane. So here it is, I'm, I'm in the kitchen right now, just so you guys know, like, this is what I'm dealing with. It's not done. Um, they're pulling out the tree. They're already doing it, they're already starting everything. Okay, they're out there right now. All right, so, the thing is I wanna put you guys in the refrigerator. Do you see it now? Do you see it now? Ugh. Let's just do it down here next to 
Lighting is so much better here. I feel like a fucking fat cow Eileen Warnos up there. All right, I'm gonna put, I'm, I'm gonna, okay, excuse me, I'm gonna show you. Okay, cool. All right, peppers, snap peas, celery, carrots, jerky pepperoni, pickles, assorted pickles there. This is shrimp. I had a couple couple days ago, but I think they might be going bad now, so that's a no. This is fasoria my mom made me that, to be honest, I don't think she did the best job on those. <laughs> I had some frickin' last night. Okay. Um, I am such a bitch. Okay, so then, okay, this is a drawer. Do you see the drawer? Okay, drawer. Radishes, cucumber, more pickled things, and then my brie. Everything else is not mine. These string cheese, I don't eat them because they're a little bit too high in calories just for snacking. Okay, so this is what we're dealing with. This, this, oh yeah, and then this is my dressing, okay? I'm gonna put you guys in here. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna put you guys in here because I want you guys to see what I do. All right, you ready? You're in my fridge, you're on that shelf, okay? And these are all my things. So I'm just gonna show you guys my face because I'm gonna show you guys what I do. So I'm gonna close the door. Don't be scared, I'll be right back. Okay. Oh my God, you guys actually have ever been in a fridge before? Okay, all right, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna pretend like, okay, now I'm gonna go, I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna pretend like I'm starving. This is what I do. Um, because I don't like to snack and I don't like to eat like lunch because I do like to just have one meal a day, okay. But I have sometimes, I get, I get really hungry around two o'clock. So this is like what I do when I'm home. Okay, so did you love me for that? Did you love me for that, okay? That's honestly what I do. I go and I shove a bunch of food in my in my face and I, that's all I buy. Like I, I told you guys I had crackers and stuff. I do, like I had the pop chips and stuff, but if I'm just gonna go and like eat, this is what I will do. I will only allow myself to have these things. These healthy, basically what I had right there, I mean, I, honestly, I don't really count vegetables, even though you should. Carrots are kind of high. Celery, I don't count. I don't count sugar snap peas. I don't count with the two peppers I have. And then these, these um, turkey pepperonis are really good because there's in 17 of them, there's 70 calories. So 
that's you know it's very low and then i have like i have capers because they're really salty and i have pickles really salty it helps the radish is a different texture cucumber i just come and i shove it in my face and i'm full like i don't i'm actually full i think because i just like shoved like that it just made me even more full because of the air like i don't know it works for me and this is the thing, like all of you fatsos out there, you fucking miserable fatsos who come after me and tell me that I'm, I'm like trying, like promoting anorexia. You're a fat ass, ugly bitch, okay? You are because you know how many emails I get from people thanking me up and motherfucking down for helping them lose weight, you fucking pig. So keep out of my business. Keep out of our business. You're not a part of the club. You're stupid, you're embarrassing, you're a fucking loser. Like, you're a fucking loser. You really are. Um, but that's it. And everyone out there, this is why I keep sharing. Like, if it was something you guys, like, didn't obviously like, if I, if I was sharing something that you guys didn't obviously like, I wouldn't share it anymore. But, like, okay, on something new. But, like, uh, you guys, uh, we love the locale. It's all about the locale. It's all, and yes, yes, I'm right. It will not kill your fat ass if you skip a fucking meal, okay? It will not kill your fat ass if you don't, or if you do skip a meal, fat out. All right, now, now they all think I'm insane. They're out there like staring in here, okay. All right, all right, guys, <laughs> all right. Um, oh, my God, why didn't I say this at first? I didn't say this at first, I'm so stupid. All of my new, new designs are at low, like low, special low prices, so don't miss out. I think everything is like at least, I think it's like everything's $5 off. So um, yeah, don't miss out. You guys know for my so certain um, things I do, I do intro prices, and it's free US shipping, so. Amazing. All right. Love you guys. Bye.